One notable feature of the agglutinative nominal system of classical Sanskrit is the very common use of nominal compounds, samasa, which may be huge, 10 plus or even 30 plus words, and are generative. Nominal compounds occur with various structures, but morphologically speaking they are essentially the same. Each noun or adjective is in its weak stem form with only the final element receiving case inflection. Topic: Avyayabhava The first member of this type of nominal compound is an indeclinable, to which another word is added so that the new compound also becomes indeclinable, i.e., avyaya. Examples, yatha plus sakti, per power, as much as possible, upa plus k arsnam, near kursna, etc. In avyayabhava compounds, the first member has primacy purva pada pradana, i.e., the whole compound behaves like an indeclinable due to the nature of the first part which is indeclinable. Titpurusa, determinative Unlike the avyayabhava compounds, in titpurusa compounds the second member has primacy uttara pada pradana. There are many types of titpurusa, one for each of the nominal cases, and a few others besides. In a titpurusa, the first component is in a case relationship with another. For example, doghouse is a dative compound, a house for a dog. It would be called a kadarthititpurusa refers to the fourth case, that is, the dative. Incidentally, the word, titpurusa, is itself a titpurusa, meaning a, that man, in the sense of, that person's man, meaning someone's agent, while, kadarthititpurusa, is a karmataraya, being both dative and a titpurusa. An easy way to understand it is to look at English examples of titpurusas, battlefield, where there is a genitive relationship between field and battle, a field of battle. Other examples include instrumental relationships, thunderstruck, and locative relationships, town dwelling. All these normal titpurusa compounds are called vyudhikarana titpurusa, because the case ending should depend upon the second member because semantically the second member has primacy, but actually the case ending depends upon the first member. Literally, vyudhikarana means opposite or different case ending. But when the case ending of both members of a titpurusa compound are similar, then it is called a karmataraya titpurusa compound, or simply a karmataraya compound. Dvigu Dvigu is a subtype of titpurusa in which the modifying member is a number. Dvigu lit. A two cow person, i.e., one who has two cows, itself is a compound, dvau plus g avau. Karmataraya descriptive. It is a variety of titpurusa as shown above, but treated separately. The relation of the first member to the last is appositional, attributive, or adverbial. E. G. Aluka yatu owl plus demon is a demon in the shape of an owl. Topic. Madhyama pada lopai samasa It is that variety of karmataraya titpurusa compound in which the middle part is implied but not present for brevity. E.g., Deva Brahmana, lit. God Brahman, concatenated from Deva Pujika Brahmana, God Worshipping Brahman. Nan Samasa Example, Na plus Brahmana. Equals a Brahmana, in which na when placed in an initial position becomes a or in before a word starting with a vowel. 
While useful in classification, this is etymologically incorrect as the at negation has not originated from na. Equals. Topic: Upapada samasa. Topic. A variety of tatpurusa compound in which nouns make unions with verbs. These compounds can be recognized by the fact that the second part contains a possibly transformed verbal root datu, kumbum plus ker. Kumbakara potter, lit. Pot maker, sastram plus janya. Topic: Sastrajna, learned person, one who knows treatises. Jalam plus da. Halada, one that gives water. Cloud. Topic: Devandva, coordinative. These consist of two or more noun stems, connected in sense with and copulative or coordinative. There are mainly two kinds of devandva, devandva pair constructions in Sanskrit. Aitaritara devandva The result of Aitaritara devandva, Aitaritara devandva enumerative devandva is an enumerative word, the meaning of which refers to all its constituent members. The resultant compound word is in the dual or plural number and takes the gender of the final member in the compound construction. For example, Ramalaksmanau Ramalaksmanau Rama and Lakshmana, equivalent to Ramaska Laksmanaska Ramas ca Laksmanas ca. It describes the sons of King Dasaratha, around whom, along with Rama's wife Sita, the epic Ramayana revolves. Ramalaksmana Bharata Satruna Ramalaksmana Bharata Satruna Rama and Lakshmana and Bharata and Shatruna, equivalent to Ramaska Laksmanaska Bharataska Satrunaska Ramas ca Laksmanas ca Bharatas ca Satrunas ca. It describes all the sons of King Dasaratha. Datulakaraparushavakanani Datulakaraparushavakanani verb stem, case, person and number, equivalent to Datuska Lakaraska Porazaska Vakanam ka Datus ca Lakaras ca Purusas ca Vakanam ca. It describes the method of describing verb inflections and conjugations. Samahara Devandva Words may be organized in a compound to form a metonym, and sometimes the words may comprise all the constituent parts of the whole. The resultant compound word exhibits Samahara Devandva, Samahara Devandva collective Devandva, and is always neuter and in the singular number. Panipadam Panipadam limbs, appendages, equivalent to Pani ka padau ka Pani ca padau ca, two hands and two feet according to some grammarians. There is a third kind of devandva, called ekasesa devandva ekashisha devandva one stem remains devandva, where only one stem remains in the compound of multiple words, this exhibits true metonymy. Pitarau Pitarau parents, equivalent to Mata ka Pita ka Mata ca Pita ca mother and father. Here, the only stem used is Pitar Pitar father, which in dual case as there are two entities, mother and father declines to give Pitarau fathers, or in this case Pitarau parents. Itaritara Devandva can also be performed to give Matapitarau Matapitarau mother and father, and this can mean precisely the same as Pitarau. Topic. Bahuvrihi, possessive Bahuvrihi, or much rice, denotes a rich person one who has much rice. Bahuvrihi compounds refer, by example, to a compound noun with no head a compound noun that refers to a thing which is itself not part of the compound. For example, low life and blockhead. 
are Bahuvrihi compounds, since a low life is not a kind of life, and a block head is not a kind of head, and a much rice is not a kind of rice, compare with more common, headed, compound nouns like fly ball, a kind of ball, or alley cat, a kind of cat. Bahuvrihis can often be translated by possessing or ed, for example, possessing much rice or much riced. In simple terms, it is a compound which is an adjective for a third word which is not a part of the compound. Alak samasa Case endings do not vanish, e.g. atmain plus padam equals atmanapadam equals Topic Amredita iterative equals a compound consisting of the same word repeated, but with the first occurrence being accented. Amreditas are used to express repetitiveness, for example, from div day we obtain dive dive day after day, daily, and from diva god we obtain devam devam or devo devas god after god. Equals. Topic notes. Equals. Topic bibliography. Devavana Pravesika, An Introduction to the Sanskrit Language, Robert P. Goldman, ISBN 0-944613-40-3 A Sanskrit Grammar for Students, A. A. McDonnell, ISBN 81-246-0094-5